The Pacific Ocean next to Vandenberg Air Force Base, the launch site for an important ocean mission. Here, over the past few weeks, preparations have been made for the launch of Sentinel-6 on a SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket. Because of the COVID-19 pandemic, many of the team are working remotely in Europe, with only a few engineers able to make the final checks on the satellite. Well, for all of us, the, uh, the launch campaign is the culmination of many years of work. And to actually see the satellite in its usually most beautiful state, uh, when you've uh, got all the covers off, you've got all the final blankets on, for all of us, uh, it's a wonderful moment, it's emotional, and uh, to see it as you see it here, nicely on the adapter for the launcher, we are really proud and looking forward to the launch. Equipped with a radar altimeter, Sentinel-6 will make the most accurate measurements yet of sea level. A joint project between Europe and the United States, Sentinel-6 will continue the legacy of almost 30 years of radar altimetry missions, starting with Topex Poseidon in 1992, and continuing through Jason 1, 2 and 3, providing an accurate record of sea surface measurements and proving that mean global sea levels are rising. We want to continue that record for another five years and demonstrate and quantify the sea level rise we have been observing since the 90s. In average, about 3.2 millimeters per year, even though the scientist tells us in the last year this has been accelerating, in particular due to the acceleration in melting of ice. So over the last years, it's above four millimeters every year we record in the sea level. Sentinel-6 will map up to 95% of the world's oceans every 10 days, taking continuous measurements of sea surface and wave height as well as wind speed. The satellite will also provide vital safety information for shipping through marine and meteorological forecasts. It will operate alongside other Sentinel satellites as part of the European Copernicus Earth Observation Programme. For me to be part of Earth's observation is special because you really do feel you're doing something that can help the future of mankind. These are the last views of Sentinel-6 before it's covered by the fairing for launch. If all goes to plan, the satellite will soon be in orbit, providing vital data to help us better understand our changing world. <laughs>